Welcome back to Sonic Central, everyone. So today, I figured we'd play some Sonic Speed Simulator and check out a lot of the new content that's in this game. It's probably not new at this point, but I haven't played this game for so long now. There's loads of this content that I'm still unaware of. So yeah, I figured, figured today we'd uh, check what's new. Ooh, yeah, right. They've got uh, Movie Sonic and Movie Tales in this game now. I can't tell if they've changed Classic Sonic here. I know, he kind of looks a bit different. I'm not sure if they've changed his animations or anything. I just, I, again, I haven't played this game for so long at this point. Cannot remember. The good thing is, is I've actually got the uh, magnet or whatever it is. So that means the rings will just go straight to us instead of having to go to them manually. But man, we've got a lot of work to do. What's that? One, is that 100 million rings? What's that for? There's just all this new stuff here. Like, what's this trade thing? Wow, you can actually trade items with people now. Let's see if there's anything new in this shop. Obviously, I've already got the this old stuff that I purchased, like the VIP thing, the infinite magnet. And twice as muck. What the hell is that? Faster egg opening, triple eggs. I think these two are old here. You can also get like a starter pack here as well. Boosts. Oh yeah, that this stuff has pretty much always been in the game. Uh, I'm not sure when they added this triple race ticket thing. That's another thing. I haven't even tried those races out. Apparently, like, Emerald Coast is in the game now. Speaking of that, let's actually go check that stuff out because, again, I don't, I've never played any of this stuff. Action race. Oh, they have City Escape. Let's check, let's check this out. All right, so there's also Green Hill. We've got Emerald Coast, of course, and City Escape. So there's, like, actual stages in this game at this point. Obviously, I'm not saying these are new, but I haven't checked any of this stuff out. What's Drag Race? Oh, no place drag race let's check city escape out so i'm pretty sure this is like a pvp sort of thing i think other people need to join this although i'm not sure oh here we go actually oh this is actually really good it kind of goes to show how fast this game really is i don't know if we're racing against someone else it looks like there's someone with like a metal sonic icon up there but i, I suppose the good thing about this is we can also collect our rings while we do this as well so Oh, wow. This looks really good. This looks really, really good. Vegetation everywhere. The thing is, I've wanted, like, stages in this game since its inception. You know what I mean? Whoa, this is decorated so nicely. A lot of dash panels here. Yeah, so it does look like there is someone in this race with us. So let's try and take the win on this one. Oh, look at this. We're just skipping the whole stage right here. I'm not sure if you can, like, flip out of bounds or whatever. Man, I love this. Imagine if there was a way to, like, like export the terrain for this and put it in another game. Ooh, we just did a massive skip here. Hell yeah, we just won. Okay, so yeah, placement first. We got 24 of those tickets. I'm not quite sure what they do. Super mega bundle. It's been this long. I didn't even know Classic Knuckles and... Cla oh, no, I think I, I think I remember Classic Tails being in the game. Never got him, though, of course. Oh no, wait, I do have him. Repurchase. But no, we got classic Knuckles here. Uh, I think the only way to get him now is if you actually buy him. Who knows, maybe I'll do that in the future. I don't know. Maybe they'll bring him back so you can like unlock him like within the game or something. I don't know. Something I've just noticed as well is it says sold out. Maybe that's like... What is this? I wonder what this is for. I mean, obviously it's for um, Knuckles, of course. We've got him here. But the hat on its own, I'm not sure what you would use that for. Maybe, like, any character can put it on. I have no idea. <laughs> I suppose we could check out the drag races. Again, I haven't seen these yet. Wait, what's that? Is that, um... Whoa, is that uh, from Sonic Riders there? Uh, Metal Madness Race. Metal City. I want to check that out. Nice, just like from Sonic Riders, you know, the original game. This really is great. It's so much better than just having to just endlessly roam, you know, those hub worlds or whatever, which is still fine, because the, the thing is with this game... No way! We can actually go on the, uh, the hoverboard. Oh my god, I was not expecting this. Although this jet, the jet the hawk in front of us is, uh, is beating us. Oh, we've overtook him. Let's try and, uh, let's try and take the, the win on this one. Can you, like, change your board? Maybe you can, I'm not sure. By the way, uh, is this like the... I can't remember the name of this board. Is it like a blue star or something like that? Ah, uh, we just missed the grind rail there. Now I'm pressing the X button on my controller and it, it does seem like we can like take it, like uh, we can boost forward. Ah, uh, we just missed the shortcut there. Hey, he looks really good. He look, Honestly, Classic Sonic looks really good. I, again, I don't know if they've changed him. 
who does look a bit different. And we, we actually, wow, we won. All right, we got another 24 tickets. I don't know what they do. I'll have to check it out. Oh, we've got a spin thing here. We've got a shadow skin here. I'm not sure what they are. Classic Knuckles is in this. Maybe we can unlock him. No, oh, wait, these are legendary spins. I don't have any, unfortunately. But we'll do the other spin. We've got a, uh, another Knuckles skin here. I'm pretty sure that's from Sonic Free Riders, I think. That's fine. Hey, this dude here, Owen P8519, has got like some. Is that Sonic Rivals? Yeah, yeah, that's Sonic Rivals on his uh, avatar there. Okay, so I just remembered that I hadn't actually got any friends equipped. So I've got my five Shadow Chow equipped here. Okay, so we obviously got the 20 min magnet boost. Now we've got to unlock the 20 minute XP boost. Okay, so I'm back a few days later. So I was able to unlock the Movie Sonic skin and of course the Movie Tail skin. But the cool thing is you also get these Movie Sonic trails as well. But yeah, here we go. Like we've got the limited event Symphony Showdown. Not sure if I'm going to unlock this whole thing today, but we can certainly have a look. Okay, so I'm pretty much halfway to get the, the Maestro Chow. Is that how you pronounce it? But then the, the super prize is that Rockstar Sonic skin. All right, so I've just come into Hilltop Zone, which I actually had to unlock through New York City because apparently I was missing a key. But yeah, I've just seen a boss event, Neo Metal Sonic. Didn't know this guy was in the game yet. I probably won't do the entire Hilltop Zone quest line today just simply because it's going to take a long time and I'd rather, you know, get all those new Sonic Symphony skins. But eventually I will because the next world is Speed Jungle Zone from Sonic Superstars. I have not seen this whatsoever, so it should be interesting to see it. All right, let's check out this Neo Metal Sonic boss battle. This is pretty cool. I did not expect anything like this. This is like a full-on supersonic boss fight. Of course, it's uh, referencing Sonic Heroes right here. Because I'm going to be honest, that, that Emerald Hill boss fight with Dr. Eggman, it was way too easy. I actually have no idea how you even attack this guy right here. Oh, nice. Okay, so once his shield drops, you can just attack him. All right, so we've done a pretty decent amount of damage. Presumably, like, the friends you have with you, like the Chow or whatever, maybe they help you, like, deal damage. I'm pretty sure they do because they have, like, a power stat. It's actually kind of a shame because I actually don't have the supersonic skin. I know he's in the game now, obviously, but you can actually unlock him as, like, a regular skin. I'm not sure how he works, whether you have to actually be regular Sonic and then collect 50 rings. Uh, I think that's how you do it. I don't know. But yeah, I don't have him, unfortunately, and I, I I can't find him anywhere, so hopefully in the future they bring him back. Unless I am missing something and he is here somewhere. Alright, we've nearly uh, we've nearly taken him out here. I genuinely did not know Neo Malsonic was in this game. He looks really good. He's probably my favorite form, you know, from uh, Metal Sonic. Oh, we did it! Ooh, what rank have we got? <laughs> Damage to Neo 3000. Oh my god, we got an S rank. Oh, we got a new music track too. Okay, so you can unlock him, but again, it's probably going to take ages. Collect Chaos Orbs in the boss fight. Yeah, I'll probably just do this off camera at some point and then just update you all with what I've unlocked. By the way, if you think you've missed that, you know, that Knuckles event and the Movie Sonic and Movie Tales event, you can still get them. I haven't actually got him yet. The, uh, the, the, the Knuckles event series Knuckles skin. That's actually not too bad, although I'm not sure where they are. But anyway, yeah, let's get on unlocking these skins right here. So apparently I already have one of these one of these things right here. But yeah, let's try, let's try and get all of these. I'm not going to show all of it, of course, because I imagine a lot of it's just, you know, a lot of grinding. Use boost for four minutes in races. All right, let's get started on that. I kind of want to see Emerald Codes because I don't think I've actually played this one yet. I haven't actually played Green Hill either. I suppose you could actually like just mess around and just keep boosting. To, to try and, like, get the numbers up or something. This is Emerald Coast. It looks great. This is probably, like... Yeah, this is this is definitely the most up-to-date look for Emerald Coast. We haven't really seen it in HD before other than, I suppose, Sonic Generations 3DS. Oh, here we go. Oh, no, there's a Metal Sonic in here. I mean, look at this. This looks this looks so good. It's so detailed. Something I mentioned in that City Escape race as well. I just love how decorated all of these stages are. Oh, yeah, I, I thought that... So look at my icon on the top left, on the top right. I thought, I thought that was another player, but it's not. It's because my Roblox mascot thing has a Sonic thing on his shoulder. All right, we've got no whale or orca or whatever, so that should make this bit a bit, a little bit easier. Yeah, they've kind of like redesigned this whole thing, which uh, I do appreciate a lot. I mean, it's you know, it's a lot better than 
just a blank bridge because they couldn't put the orca in or whatever. Actually, I want to see if this works. Oh my god, it does. No, wait, hold on. It threw, it threw me out of bounds. That's a pretty good shortcut in the original game. I think we've taken the, uh, the win on this one. Nice. Oh wait, I'm pretty sure that LEGO Dimensions game also had Emerald Coast. So I suppose like other than this, that's the most up-to-date version of Emerald Coast, which looks great by the way. All right, I'm back again. So unfortunately this week, I've had a lot of issues with this with this computer. It keeps blue screening, hence why it's taken so long to record this video. But hopefully I fixed the problem. So yeah, this should, this should be the final take. But thankfully because Roblox is also on mobile, I've actually managed to make a quite a lot of progress during this week. As you can see, we've actually got our uh, movie Sonic skin to level 4, I think. Let me just double check. Yeah, so we've gotten to Aura 4. We're pretty much halfway to getting to level 5. I didn't realize how long this was going to take. But during this week as well, I've just pretty much explored all the new worlds as well. I obviously, I've already... I think I did a video on this, so I've already explored this. Had a look at Hilltop. I think they've changed that. Speed Jungle, really like this zone. I love the lighting in this zone. No place is pretty cool too. I like how it's like an underwater, you know, sort of underwater world. And you can also drown in it. I actually kind of like that addition. In fact, this is actually the only level I haven't explored yet because reaching level 45 took so long. Like I've only just unlocked this zone. And during the week as well, I've, I've unlocked the Knuckles event, the series Knuckles skin, which I hated this so much. Collecting those dumbbells was a pain because you can only carry five at a time. And then you have to go back and drop them off one by one. But yeah, we've got all the movie skins now. So today, we've got one more thing. There's one more thing I want to do now. And that's get the, the Sonic Symphony Shadow skin and the hoverboard thing. I think that requires, tw uh, you know, 20 of those music notes. I've only collected one so far. So in this video, we're going to sort of have a, a little explore and uh, find 20 of them. I don't think you need to find all of them. You just need to find 20. I just need to quickly double check that. All right, so you need to find 20 of them to get the Rockstar Shadow skin, which looks great. We've obviously got uh, both of these right here. And, oh, right, so it's only 10 to get this one. I gotta say, I've been having a great time with this game. Honestly, this is like the best time to come back to this game in, in 2024. There is so much content. There's so many things to do. Actually, I haven't looked at the jukebox yet. Let's see. Oh, so you can actually, uh, can you change the music in the, in the level? Oh my god, you can. We can play Episode Shadow. Oh, this is in Sonic Runners, right? Okay. Speed Jungle Act 1. Oh yeah, this is... Oh yeah, Eggman Land Knight. This is a great track. Oh, that's another thing I need to do. I also need to get Neo Metal Sonic unlocked. All right, so we need 18 more music notes. We're just gonna... Again, we're just gonna explore. Okay, so I've just found one near Big as well. What's this? Oh, nice. Tropical Coast. But yeah, like I said, really enjoying this game now. If you gave up on this game definitely recommend give it another try there is so much content here obviously there's still loads of grinding which i suppose they want you to do throughout the week before like i don't know a new event starts but i don't know some of the requirements are just insane like those dumbbell challenges did that was probably my least favorite so far again because you can only hold five at a time all right we're gonna have a little look down here this is actually really nice i like how they've expanded upon city escape like you know, I imagine like in Sonic Adventure 2, maybe Sonic's over there or something like that. I don't know. Or he's over there. I'm not sure. But again, like this is kind of like a, like a small open world sort of thing. I really like it. I actually saw a video uh, yesterday and someone clipped out of bounds here with Super Sonic. And they, they ended up in Metal Harbor. So who knows? Like maybe we'll see Metal Harbor soon. Maybe it'll be like a uh, racetrack or something. I'm not sure. Anyway, we found another music note. Let's see what it is. Nice. Emerald Coast. Perfect. I gotta say, I like how the jukebox cycles songs. Like, it doesn't just, like, loop them over and over again. All right, I can't see any on the, any of these boats here, so I suppose we can look elsewhere. Oh, cool. You can actually go onto the... This, like, this looks straight out of Radical Highway. Oh, that's nice. We can actually grind on the bridge, too. Maybe there's a, a music note over here somewhere. I will say, and unless it's just because I'm bad at the game, which I am, I can't seem to find any more music notes. These seem to be really well hidden away. So maybe it might be time to explore a new world. All right, so I've managed to find another one. Is it literally in plain sight? I'm not sure how I missed this one, but let's see what it is. Oh, nice. Escape from the city instrumental. That's perfect. Oh, I haven't actually explored down here. Just like from Radical Highway. Again, I really like how, like, big this map is. It's huge. All right, I guess we can go take a look in Emerald Hill. 
All right, found another one. This is near Tails Workshop. Let's see. Work it out from Sonic R. Very nice. I suppose the reality is I only think there's like 30 something music notes in this in this game. So they are going to be really well hidden when you think about how many maps are in this game now and how big they are. You know what I mean? So of course they're going to be a little hard to find. Right, I found another one. It's literally right at the beginning of this zone. Let's see what it is. All right, I'm going to have one more scout of this world now and see if we can at least find one more. If not, I'll move on. There's probably loads of mist in City Escape and, you know, the, the Green Hill world, but... So, yeah, we're in the cave now. I actually forgot this was in the game. Oh, there's one there. Look. Let's try and get to it. If we can just jump there. Nice. What is it? All right, let's move on to a... Let's move Let's move on to a new world. Let's go to Hilltop Zone. Scratch that. We'll go to Lost Valley first, actually. So, we found another one. It's actually by this red ring. Do they give you... Oh, nice. They give you, they give you 10. That's really cool. All right, let's have a look at this. To be honest, I'm probably just going to keep the jukebox on from now on, just purely because I've heard the music in this game, like, so many times now. Obviously, apart from the worlds that I've, you know, been in, I haven't been in yet, but I think the jukebox is, like, a really good addition. All right, we're in New York City now, so let's have a good explore of this place. Okay, there's one hidden in here. What is it? I actually really like that track. It's from uh, Sonic Forces, which, say what you want about Sonic Forces, it's got a solid soundtrack. I love it. I think that's, like... Have we got 10 now? I think we have. So yeah, we've got 10. It probably popped up on the screen, but I wasn't paying attention. We're probably going to have to backtrack to a few areas because I've certainly missed a few. There's probably some in this level here, Green Hill, which I've probably missed. But what we'll do is we'll go to the other areas we haven't gone to yet. And if we still haven't found 10 more, I suppose we can, uh, you know, revisit these previous areas. Okay, so we found another one. Let's see what it is. Rusty Ruin Zone Act 2 from Sonic 3D. I love that stage and I love that music as well. Both Rusty, like the Act 1 and Act 2 are really good. Although that could be, you know, the Mega Drive Genesis version. Either way, solid tracks. Okay, I found another one. Wow, this is really high up. I mean, just look how high we are. I kind of just boosted around, jumped up, and there it was. So let's have a look at it. We're in Speed Jungle now. I gotta say, I love the lighting of this zone. I'm gonna turn this character aura off as well, just so you can see it. I gotta say, I love this movie Sonic skin. I'm probably gonna be using this, like, primarily. I'm pretty sure we've got eight to find now, something like that. So I do have a feeling we're gonna have to backtrack to a few areas. These are surprisingly hidden. Like, seriously, I I'm struggling to find these things. Right, so there is one at the end of... It's, it's up here. It's pretty much right at the top of the map. I'm going to avoid this ring here just in case uh, it boosts me away. What if we... Oh. Oh, there's another one here. Wait, which one is it? Did, the music track didn't pop up. Oh, here it is. Oh, cool. From uh, Sonic Adventure 2. Right, now we need to get back to the top of the map. Let's just try and be a bit more accurate. There we go. Nice. Special stage. That's a bit vague. That could be from any game, but I suppose we can uh, check it out on the jukebox. Oh, it's from Sonic 3D Blast. The Saturn version. But they also are. Ah, so the, the Rusty Ruin Zone Act 2 is also from the Sega Saturn version. I'm going to play that because that is a great track. Right, so here we are in no place. Again, I really like this map. I think it's excellent. Okay, so this is a, another skin I haven't got. Again, there are so many skins I haven't got in this game. I'll probably get them in my own time. We've got Chaos Sonic here. Right, so I'm pretty sure we've got like six to get now or or eight it's something like that i keep forgetting i'm not really paying much attention here gotta say i'm a little bit burnt out from this now it's also really hot here in the uk so yeah i'm just not having a great time right now but hopefully we, we can get this done relatively quick now oh wow we found one we found one already nice what is it water bike is that from sonic rush adventure i'm pretty sure it is i do like how they've brought these you know, these uh, music notes into the game. I'm pretty sure the first game to do something like this was actually Sonic Unleashed because some of the collectibles in that game were like turntables or like vinyl and you could like go to, you know, that place in Spagonia and play music from there. But then they also brought this back in, what is it? Sonic Generations, I'm pretty sure. In fact, I think the mesh they're using for the music notes is actually from Sonic Generations. I think it's like a vector mission or something. I could be wrong about that. I just realized, is that Nibrox logo? You know, the, the Sonic 3D, like, the, you know, the modeler who works on this game too? I'm pretty sure that is the logo. That's pretty cool. And we found another one. What is this? Coral Cave. Sonic Rush Adventure, is it? I don't know. I can't remember. I think it might be. I know it's, it must be on one of the DS games. All right, let's move on to a new world and then 
we'll probably have to backtrack somewhere else. I'm sure there's probably one or two I've missed in Green Hill and Lost Valley and things like that. This world is just too big and I just, I'm way too hot right now to be focusing on a massive world such as this. Right, so I haven't been to this world yet. This is Cyber Station. Of course, it's from Sonic Superstars. Is that a music note already? Cyberspace 1, 2, flowing. Nice. That's actually already in this game. It's in the time trials. Well, at least we found one, uh, straight, you know, right from the start. That's pretty cool. Wow, we found another one already. That was quick. Bingo party lap music. And we found a third one. Battle with Egg Dragoon. Right, so we only need one more to find now. And I imagine there is maybe one I've missed here. So I guess we can go look for it. If not, I'm sure there's one I've missed, you know, in City Escape or whatever. But yeah, we'll just take a good look. We only need to find one more, so... That's great. We're not we're not going to find all 32 in this video because this is probably not the most interesting things to watch. And also, I'm kind of burnt out from doing this now. I've been, again, I've been trying to do this video for like a week. Oh, there's there it is. Oh, we found the we found the last one we need. I was actually about to give up hope of going to a new world, but here we go. So which one's this going to be? So we do have the Rockstar Shadow and Locked Event Strategy. Okay, so the Water Bike and the Coral Cave were both from Sonic Rush Adventure. Team Sonic Racing was the Bingo Party one. Oh, Sonic Forces was the Egg Dragoon Mark II. And Event Strategy, yeah, Sonic Adventure 2. I'm pretty sure the event gave it away because that's how they kind of name the music tracks in that game. All right, so here we go. We've got the, the Symphony Shadow Skin as well as the Hoverboard. Something I should actually note is I'm going to the Sonic Symphony in Paris next month. So if you're going to be there, then uh, yeah, definitely come say hello. That'd be pretty cool. I actually can't wait for it. I was going to go to the London one last year, but just wasn't able to make it. So yeah, I'll be in Paris to see that on, uh, I think it's the 2nd of June. So that's pretty much it for this video then. Sorry if this video seems kind of all over the place. I did want to get this video out days ago, but again, my, my PC's really been acting up. So, so it's kind of been a gradual process to get this video out. But thankfully, because of the Roblox mobile app, I was able to sort of grind a bit more on that. But yeah, as for future content on this game, I am going to try and get as many videos out as I possibly can. So yeah, maybe we can get a video out once a week. I think that'd be pretty cool because my interest in this game is it's back. You know what I mean? I, I really, I've been really enjoying this game. Maybe I'm saying that because I haven't played it for so long and there's all this content here. You know, the people that have been playing this game regularly, maybe they are indifferent on it. I'm not, in, I'm not quite sure. But yeah, we got the movie skins. We got all of these symphony skins. I also grinded a few other stuff like the mastery and all that stuff. So I think I made pretty good progress in a week. And yeah, I'm going to try and stay up to date with all the new events that come out. So thanks for watching, everyone. If you're new around here, be sure to subscribe for more Sonic videos. And I will catch you in the next one.